Hi Godspeed, welcome into my channel. This channel is about astronomy, science in general. I discovered that the Big Bang's Big Bang is false and the distance uh, at the stars is false. And the stars are cold, small and close, very close. And they are not like our sun, many things. But uh, to try to bring people to my channel because in the process of discovering that the Big Bang is false, I discovered that 90% of this actual science in the current day is false. So in this process I said let's demonstrate to many people that the science is wrong. Maybe because I, I already told many arguments that the stars are close and, and to understand that they are crazy. They are people and they are crazy people. Scientists are crazy people. The 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 biggest religions and the bigger light uh, uh, on the 200 years uh, from 200 years, the bigger liars and the bigger religion that existed. So I joke like they, they discover these new particles, crazy, and and I so I started I I started a list to take on you some YouTube guys that present false science. But indirectly to prove to you that they, if they speak crazy science, if you understand that they are speaking crazy science, so to raise a doubt that the Big Bang is, is, uh, is false in your heart and in your mind, okay? So this is the reason, if you understood. So I started to take four videos on, on, on one guy from YouTube. This is uh, my third video. Uh, I said like again Sabine, Hosan Felder, but in this video she is speaking very nice, like I am friend with her, in this video I am like a friend, okay? So, about particle physics, but, but, but she says that it is a professional particle physics, but I want to tell her that even the standard particle, uh, particles are false, do not exist and are false, okay? So, if you follow news about particle physics, then you know that it comes in three types. It's either that they haven't found that thing they were looking for, or they've come up with something new to look for, which they'll later report not having found, or it's something so boring you don't even finish reading the headline. How come that particle physicists constantly make wrong predictions? And what will happen next? That's what we'll talk about today. Okay, but so I want to be friend. I put with her. I put even from from uh, her, her words to for you to understand that they are crazy. They are invented many particles. She says this, okay? So I am friendly like with her in this video. So she says that they, they, she is very, very like nice. Like she uh, spoke she spoke this video very nice, very good video, okay? But I want to tell you why they did this. You see, this is the particle, PhD particle, professor doctor particles. They wanted to take their doctorates and they invented what they wanted. The list of things that particle physicists said should exist, but that no one's ever seen, is very long. No supersymmetric particles, no proton decay, no dark matter particles, no WIMPs, no axions, no sterile neutrinos. There's about as much evidence for any of those as for Bigfoot, though Bigfoot would probably have got me more views. Some particle physicists even predicted unparticles, and those weren't found either. It's been going like this for 50 years, ever since the 1970s. And I'm telling you that even the standard, standard 16 for, uh, particles are false. Even though she says in the video that we are proved somehow at the Hadron Collider's acceleration, CERN and uh, Fermilab in the United States, you don't believe that they, they could be liars or, be, or they are if they are not liars, they, 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 they wanted to, to prove that they have some salaries not worth, like, worthless, like, they are stealing from the state. Now, Chinese made one, nowadays, like, a, a hadron collider, like, a, a particle collider, Chinese made a particle collider. So, 
so but they, but they are stupid and wrong okay so 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 let me tell you even if, if this will going to be a big video but i'm telling you that the particles do not exist even the electron is not known and the proton and neutron <laughs> so so 90 percent of this actual science is wrong i'm telling you this is the only two good formulas like this there are more experiments that have looked for all kinds of other particles which continue to not find them. There are headlines about this literally every couple of weeks. The Panda X4T experiment looked for light fermionic dark matter. They didn't find it. The Stereo experiment looked for sterile neutrinos. They didn't find them. CDX didn't find light WIMPs. Hess didn't find any evidence for WIMP annihilation. The microscope experiment didn't find a fifth force. An experiment called Sensei didn't find sub-GV dark matter, and so on. The pattern is this. Particle physicists invent particles, make predictions for those invented particles, and when these predictions are falsified, they change the model and make new predictions. They say it's good science because these hypotheses are falsifiable. I'm afraid most of them believe this. The only two, and Einstein is wrong, and particle science, and mechanical qu mechanic quantic is wrong. And Okay, so for this let me tell you some history. They, there was Galileo, okay, B because Sabine does not know what gravity is. From the video, from the video, her videos, I understood this, okay. They are searching particles, gravity particles, gravity waves, and things like they prove, this is proving that they do not know even what gravity is. One final objection I want to mention usually doesn't come from particle physicists but from people in other fields who think that we need all these models to explain dark matter. But that's mixing up two different things. We need either dark matter or a modification of gravity to explain observations in astrophysics and cosmology. But if it's dark matter, then the only thing we need to explain observations is how the mass is distributed. Gravity is this force. Force equal mass time acceleration. You put two bodies that moves in a circle, like this, like this. You know the speed doesn't, you do not calculate it through mass. You know the speed, you observe it. In the case of the Earth, there's 365 days, the orbit of the Earth. You know the speed, it's the same speed. And you know in the speed, <coughs> you calculate the mass somehow of the Earth through density, a medium density, things like this, indirectly. So you know the force that must be applied to produce a constant movement to the Earth. You calculate the same on, on the sky, the orbit of Mars, you know indirect, uh, indirectly how the, they are moving on the sky, the Mars, okay? So you deduce the circle. And then from Newton, force they do not know they are saying that the retraction you put two forces two masses and two accelerations of the two bodies that are orbiting each other the moon around the earth or the satellite around the uh, but the but the speed is observed it is not calculated so they are mistaking that the mass produces gravity mass does not produce gravity so on short to explain to her that this is gravity okay but now in the particle physics, she is saying very nice things, okay, and very good things. I'm not filming myself straight. Maybe someday I will film myself straight. This is the way I'm liking. I, I like to, to film myself. And I'm saying like a tea science or a coffee or something to drink. I have this uh, soluble coffee. I have here always something to drink. But now about particle physics. Let me tell you how the whole thing started i started to tell you okay galileo measured through some chronometer a clock like a clock the falling universal speed on earth is 9.8 meter per second square 10 meters you all all have cars okay he measured this doesn't matter this is true a any object this this is the first trick that he, this big body with a smaller one will fall 10 meters per second. 
that you do not want to understand squared for now. So the rate it will be 10 meters in a second, it, all, all the bodies you throw from a mountain, a rock, from a building, no matter the mass. And this is, will tell you that they are tricking themselves. They are saying that the mass is produced somehow. It is a relation between a force and the mass. You know the mass, I hit with a force. If I hit with a bigger acceleration, it is a relation between force and mass. Mass does not produce gravity because force is gravity. It's a force. So, so now, so now Newton made this F equals M of acceleration. Okay, he said if it, it is this acceleration, so the mass of the object will differ in the top of the mountain from the Newton book. It is will be less heavier, and on the ground will be heavier. So, so the vector, if you want, it is different just because of Galileo. Okay. But then now they do not understand that Newton did not calculate the orbits. They did, he did not calculate the orbits. Like if this body will move around so, or another body, if you know the speed, how the, he completes the circle, you must know that there is a constant force to hit that body to maintain the speed. Because you know the mass and you know that this is, this is the rate of energy, of acceleration or, or over the force to put in the system. If you know the rate of, of losing the energy. So, because, or, or, or the force, because you know the rate, you see this is, it pull the brakes, I give some force in this and it put the brakes. So I know the rate of consuming of the momentum. So if the earth will move through a field, a force field, it might be charged constantly and he did not do it. So, so, so he did not make that the mass produce gravity. You understand? He put this force and he said like, now you put it this force and you treat masses and forces. You deduce everything like in geometrical manner. So now they do not understand this. Okay. But this was the second thing. So Newton did not calculate it a bit fast. And then Leibniz confused this kinetic energy I already explained to you. But why I have told you this? This is the only good physics that exists. One final objection I want to mention usually doesn't come from particle physicists, but from people in other fields who think that we need all these models to explain dark matter. But that's mixing up two different things. We need either dark matter or a modification of gravity to explain observations in astrophysics and cosmology. But if it's dark matter, then the only thing we need to explain observations is how the mass is distributed. Then, then appears electricity and this was the chaos brought. Electricity, you see, they observed that there are some electrical I'm telling you about particle physics, I promise, so I, I will tell you, okay, I am a friend, like, you saw what she is saying, so you will collaborate with what I am saying, okay, so they, they lived in 1700s, you see, 26, after 1700s, the electricity was discovered by many guys, not Benjamin, if you are American, you will see that Benjamin ring, frankly, Many people experiment with electricity. You can produce this by, by some, if you, if you are they doing like this, some materials. You, so they try to captivate. They invented the first battery, like the battery piles. They put some like this, one on top of the, uh, another to, to store this electricity because they observed they could produce it with some mechanical movement. They knew mechanical movements like this. So. So do you observe, I'm telling you like in, in an easy way because this is the science and this is the correct language. Everything that is above this is the lies, they are lies. With that particle physics, quantum mechanics, these are lies, okay? So they took a, a, a big rock of copper rock, like copper metal, this, like this. I'm telling you science, real science how historically was, okay? So they, they knew copper and they made small wires. They observed that the electricity, it 
it flows through through some wires. But this is science, my friend. Okay, so so they did wires like we have in this current drill, more finer. You, you see wires, you see they did from copper wires, and then they observe it. They connect to some rod of iron and with the copper with the copper bobbin you can transmit it energy at the distance and in the meantime was the fir first form of, of light of light bulb invented so it is necessary that you transmit this movement but what it is this movement it is electron electricity what it is this movement it is the electron the electricity what it is they do not know even in this current day if, if I'm telling you like this you are saying that I'm crazy but they are crazy okay so I cannot be like I try to be open like but do you understand that how much they are lying with the entire universe and the, and, and the old schools on the earth are teaching many years like uh, they arrest the people and they teach them false science they cannot be like I try to okay but I cannot be so then Hertz came I'm telling you this is this is electricity they name electricity and 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 what I've told you Maxwell even is false because you see you put a rod of iron rod like this straight and with bobbins with copper bobbins like this a bobbin a, a spire you you put uh, somewhere in a spire like this circular and in the middle you have some iron and if you move this with mechanical work doesn't matter how do you produce it you can put a horse to produce it or you can give with your hand like this or you can run you produce a mechanical work and you spin these two different metals objects a iron rod and with it some irons this will produce the electricity and now why Maxwell is crazy because he says But I'm telling you that I'm t I, I told you that the science is wrong. But, so you you transmit already a, a field rotating field like this, but you produce it like the source like this, right? hydro central, hydroelectric power. No, so so Tesla did the first hydroelectric power from this property because they observe that if you move something, they, you produce uh, electricity. And and they and they they were lying. These guys were inventors, and they the scientist guy wanted to be so Maxwell. What it said, but if you have a, 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 a like on a wire, like you the the it goes like this. So the magnetic electromagnetic field will, will go like this because he was the first to try to combine the electricity with magnetism. Okay. But if you already transmit it like this because the, you spin some field at the hydrocentral like this through a wire, why do you then you say that the electricity makes like this? So, so they are false, they do not have control on their minds, okay? If I produce in another mad electricity, you could not say that electromagnetic field like in the straight line will produce a magnetic field like this. They observe that two wires with with electricity, you see I'm speaking like easy, but it is true. They would attract like magnets, the new magnets, and he tried to see if you vary the electricity, the frequency of electricity, how you vary the, the field of magnetism. But if you do not know what it is electricity, maybe it is light, you transmit light through wires. Maybe magnetism is somehow light. Okay, so gravity, maybe, maybe, okay, so, so, then they, you are giving yourself to be tough, already you say that you transmit like this, and you then you say if you have an electromagnetic field, you produce like a right hand, hand. this, he, he, he did some formulas, maybe they are true, but it is in, 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 a, in a fixed way manner, like you have this cup, or you have this stuff, so you have some law, okay, so then, to take money, I'm telling you real, real stuff, and I will, I will come to the practical science, okay? So then they wanted, 
to take money. How do you uh, uh, take money from, from people? You must tell how much electricity you are sending here, okay? So they inventing like, like you, you, you put on the, on, on water, meter water. You know how much volume of water flows through a tube. So they invented a meter, similar meter, to register through some pieces how much energy flows through a wire. I'm telling you, it seems easy to you, but it is science. This is science. But they are lying, okay? So to take money from the people because they did not invent it. Tesla guy made the first hydro central with, with all principles, with that copper bobbin and uh, producing mechanic work with 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 a river flow maybe the river uh, gives the light energy and you spin it and the river it, it takes it from the earth and from the and this is the gravity okay <clears throat> but doesn't matter okay so then so 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 then they make this piece to take you money from you and they were lying that they, they know the electron but if in the sense like they calculated the smaller piece of energy and and this is the con the, the concept of particles appear now hertz appeared i'm telling you real history science to understand my 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 heart is for you to understand the big bang is false but that you do understand that I'm not crazy, okay? So I intersected what Sabine says. This is the only video that it is, even though she is a particle scientist, with what I'm saying, that you to understand, okay, that there are many people uh, that try to find the truth, okay, and I'm telling you the truth, okay? So then Hertz come, came in 1800s. A simple apparatus, if you break these two wires, there is a simple scheme. You have, you have the same copper wiring like this. It is very important. You make some spiral copper wiring. It's very important with <laughs> electricity. And you already, so I'm telling you, it seems crazy. If I've told you, like with the equation, with I'm, I will be much smarter, but, but they are lying with the equation. And I'm telling you the truth. He observed that if you pull the electricity through two wires, they produce a spark. And some from some accident, he had another two brake wires like this. And this, it was the first antenna he captivated from the distance, the spark. And now, here, is, here if you, I, I must have told you the, the previous history. Because this is where the particle physics intervened. Here in chemistry. Now, if you see this part, it is a particle. What kind of particle? This is the electron. So Feynman says like they calculate it at a decimal the electron, like a smaller electricity. But they are lying if you do not understand if it is a relation with electromagnetic wave it produces a spark like this and you variate the frequency like you move you move like this let's say the spark will be producing like you can code them this is the radio the the, the radio you can code some signal okay from bell they invented the microphone and the speaker so you vary some field like i'm speaking like in a membrane like this and my my speaks my 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 words are influencing a membrane and this membrane has a relation, geometrical re re relation with some elect electro electric field. So in the sense it is making a function between my words and the electric field. So the electric field has capacity of geometry. Okay, so so this is well, the, the telephone. All of the things were inventions and they were lying, okay. so. So now Einstein came and said, has mass, does not have mass, this has mass, does not have mass, and this part, okay, and from chemistry, 
so it is a bigger video but you see this is the way are tricking you so all the particles are false all the particles i'm telling you they do not have any equation this is the only equation that they did like this like this like i've told you phd equation this is i want to take a phd and i like what and you can uh, you see so she says let's 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 suspend the rationament for now she says she says that strong forces electromagnetism and this is what the standard model was made but i've told you already that maxwell is crazy but particle physicists believe there'd be more to find indeed i'd guess most of them still believe this today or at least they tell you they believe it Already in the 1970s, they said that the standard model wasn't good enough because it collects three different fundamental forces. That's the electromagnetic, the strong and the weak nuclear force. Particle physicists wanted those to be unified to one force. Why? Because that'd be nicer. Theories which combine these three forces are called grand unified theories. You get them by postulating a bigger symmetry than that of the standard model. Grand Unified Theories, GUTS for short, reproduced the standard model in the range that it had been tested already, but led to deviations in untested ranges. Because you already have a feel like through wire, copper wiring. So what do you connect electromagnetism with strong forces? What forces? You, you understand that it's, they're crazy, mathematically fooled and are fooling everybody. I've told you that Maxwell is, is wrong, you understand? So what strong forces? If you have now, you understand what strong forces is, you want to break this copper in two. You infer that this is the strong forces, atom forces, but you do not know what exactly is copper. If you change the geometry, if, if you understand, because you cannot deduce the strong forces, they are saying that they are what connects the atom together. So now they connect electromagnetism that it is, it is made for wires, copper wires, with some strong forces that it is a Newton force, a breaking force of the material, F equals M or A. If you have this rock in chemical compound, you break it, you know the force. You deduce that it is the strength of the force per volume to infer that it is the force of H atoms, like, uh, like the small atoms. And then they combine this, there is no connection in chemistry with, if you have two liquids like this, water and coffee. You, you, they, they made the equation between the electron and the power proton in chemistry. It is not this electron. <laughs> so you see that it seems crazy, but they are crazy. They are extremely crazy. You do not realize that they are lying the entire planet on the schools and everybody. But particle physicists believe there'd be more to find. Indeed, I'd guess most of them still believe this today. Or at least they tell you they believe it. Already in the 1970s, they said that the standard model wasn't good enough because it collects three different fundamental forces. That's the electromagnetic, the strong and the weak nuclear force. Particle physicists wanted those to be unified to one force. Why? Because that'd be nicer. Theories which combine these three forces are called grand unified theories. You get them by postulating a bigger symmetry than that of the standard model. Grand unified theories, GUTS for short, reproduced the standard model in the range that it had been tested already, but led to deviations in untested ranges. And can, they can manipulate the electricity. They have hydrocentral. They can make light because somebody invented the light bulb, the LED bulbs. Somebody invented the microphone. Somebody, these were inventions, okay? And then they are lying that they did it somehow this. But this... All the physics be beyond Newton is false. It's false. So what, what they connected to make a standard particle theory? What they, what they did? 
The 1970s particle physicists completed what's now called the standard model. The standard model of particle physics collects all the fundamental particles that matter is made of and their interactions. When the model was completed, not all these particles had yet been measured, but one after another, they were experimentally confirmed. There are some calculus on chemistry. You combine some atoms between them, like you have uh, salt, uh, salt with water and you combine it you see they did the molecular masses like avogadro and that to say if you have one mass and you combine with another you make a solution with combined masses and somehow they infer like this and they propose this proton electron but it is a relation between electricity and electron when you mix sugar with water to make a solution with water that you understand that to be some some com electric combination like this electric combination so so and the atoms were synthesized, synthesized like per volume you you make a cube from a matter like in you you put it on the scale in you 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 in this way you make the different atoms you know that iron differs from copper because if you make the same cube or the same dimensions you put it on a scale and you have different masses. You understand? So, so, but this cube have any relation with electricity? And they're crazy. And then Einstein, because nobody made it. Let's say that he said something, uh, Maxwell, but in a wire, in a, in a wire, uh, there is electricity, magnetism. You observe that the magnets are pulled towards and the electricity towards the magnets and things like this. You have some relation like engineering to help you somehow but the science is crazy and now Einstein came and said what's the mass of the electricity electricity and they do not understand because you see if you if you are if you are saying that this you say you say the e, e equal mass times c squared you, you put this on the scale like this they say it has 100 grams, you multiply it by c squared, you have the energy. Because the energy is a property of movement, you see. You have the same mass. But you see, even that is this very, the field is very. It varies. It, it will be, look, it will make in another way. So the frequency, you can vary the frequency in many ways. But the mass is the same. So what Einstein did? Nothing. If you now take the hertz, and with that sparkle, you understand that mechanical mechanic quantity is false. Because you do not know what exactly is this field. It is maybe a light, light field, but how it moves. Hey, I don't actually think that those particles I'm going on about here exist. But please give me money anyway, because I'm smart. And maybe while I write useless papers, I'll have a good idea about something else entirely. I'm sure that'll fly. So then they try to isolate, like I'm telling you the full history. They try to isolate in an electromagnetic field uh, uh, a single electron to shoot it, okay? And things. So you can calculate somehow a, a smaller piece of energy, but on what materials this is very important. Believe me or not, I'm telling you the truth. When I told you, I have some previous videos with my guitar to explain the mechanic quantics. That you understand that it is somehow impossible to put it in the same formula. Already in the 1970s, they said that the standard model wasn't good enough because it collects three different fundamental forces. That's the electromagnetic, the strong and the weak nuclear force. Particle physicists wanted those to be unified to one force. Why? Because that'd be nicer. Theories which combine these three forces are called grand unified theories. You get them by postulating a bigger symmetry than that of the standard model. Grand unified theories, guts for short, reproduced the standard model in the range that it had been tested already, but led to deviations in untested ranges. So if they try to find a formula to unite strong forces, what strong forces? Atomical strong forces? that bounds what like this but if i put if i put copper in some solution what is the strong force to break the copper and how will make the connection 
in chemistry was invented like ele electron and proton and the physics guys are stupid. Do not understand this. They do not understand this. And I'm telling you, but but I didn't want to, to do this kind of videos, okay? But to understand that I'm no physics and this science on entire plan is false. They arrest the, the children to to for PhD they like and this Sabine girl tells you uh, she's a particle physic tells you that they are lying for money she tells you that they are lying for money you do not believe that they are lying for money they take from Switzerland and uh, money for the government and they were like they must produce something they were lying that they find a bosom that it gives mass to matter but they're crazy they're crazy you do not know if light has if, has mass you do not know I don't have I don't I don't have any words how to tell you things anymore okay so but but I, I try okay the W and Z bosons were discovered in 1983 at CERN the top quark was discovered in 1995 at Fermilab and the last one was the Higgs boson which was found at CERN in 2012 it was the final nail in the coffin of the standard model there are no more particles left to look for so this is the, 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 the formula that unite all the forces, PhD and money, dudes. And, and, from, and, and from Leibniz, they resist false science. This is the only two correct equation. But if, if, if you, it is proved that it is for there are two from a mechanical movement, it is something wrong here even. It is a proof. So I prove to you that the physics, physics is crazy science. You do not understand. Some guys invented the electricity. Tesla made the first hydro central. This Hertz guy observed that it produces a simple sparkle between two. You produce a field. This was given birth for a radio. Bell invented the microphone and you see. So they can isolate some particles because you can catch this sparkle in electromagnetic field. You can make it to go from so directions and they are lying that this is the electron from chemistry i'm telling you with all my heart they invented two particles phd particles and these crazy particles this is not any more uh, joke you see <laughs> but because it is said it is said and then they like many things that the stars are are making fusion, atomic fusion, this, all these things I discover and I cannot tell you, you see, you do not have belief, but you believe in them. And they do not have any correct science, okay? So there are some engineering science of breaking of materials derived from Newton and you know some frequencies of electricity to take money from people okay you must know how much energy you give them on volume of time to can put some money on it okay but you do not give them free like even though you do not know what you are sending to them light or, or the electron you do not know you do not know what this this was the picture was invented the movie was invented all of them were inventions by the grace of God, and they are lying with the science. And in all times, it is not was like in the present times, because now current day, they uh, now fifty years ago, the school was not obligatory, like twelve degrees. There is in China third degree school even, high school. They did not have fifty years ago. Now they arrest the children to force them to teach them false science and you wonder why they are shooting the schools. What to learn? What to learn? The chemistry is even wrong. I will tell you maybe if I make this a near two projects. I didn't want to. I wanted only to tell you that the stars are, are close. And I don't I know how to tell you that you believe me that the science is wrong. But I, but I discovered this, that the science is wrong, okay? A big video, an hour video. But, but 
I don't have any choice, okay? So particles physics. Another objection that particle physicists often bring up is that this guessing worked in the past. But if you look at past predictions in the foundations of physics, which turned out to be correct and that did not just confirm an existing theory, then it was those which made a necessary change to the theory. The Higgs boson, for example, is necessary to make the standard model work. Antiparticles predicted by Dirac are necessary to make quantum mechanics compatible with special relativity. Neutrinos were necessary to explain observations. Three generations of quarks are necessary to explain CP violation and so on. Then, so you can isolate a piece, a small piece of this sparkle and you can control it through some electromagnetic field. The same, the same, the neutron is false and the proton, they are only chemistry entities and they are in another way made like with valences to combine masses that you know on volume, okay? So it is not the electron and from physics, it is not, they are crazy, okay? So maybe believe me or not, they are crazy. You, so they put crazy for, for in the Bible says, the crazy says that uh, there's no God. That like Psalm 13 and 52. The crazy guys say that there is no God and they say reverse like that who says there is God is crazy. You see, they put everything like upside, upside down. Okay, they do not have any formulas. They do not have, you do not believe that for PhDs, they invented the 16 particles because they can, it is not a coherent connection between hydrogen and all the men they live. So even if you cross some hydrogen particles and some particle acceleration and you put energy in it, you see some scratches electromagnetic of, uh, field, like in, rep in light representation, because you cannot see otherwise. So then you say that there are particles that the particles exist in all the Mendeleev if you accelerated, let's say, a spark of iron or a sparkle of, of copper. They are stupid, they don't have control of their minds and they are stupid and they do not know this. Maybe somebody will hear this and will understand. I'm telling you, I only, I only wanted to tell you this, that the stars are cold. They do not make fusion, the fusion is not exist. You understand how they are, they are liars. And you understand I know physics, but I cannot tell you formulas that are stupid, crazy formulas. Quantum mechanics and that Schrodinger guy that said that this sparkle, this spark of this uh, simple apparatus of Hertz, has mass and he knew the, the movement through. Because you cannot put in a single equation the whole possibility of, of, of geometry, mechanic geometry. Mechanics means to move, movement. The quantum, quanta means light. So you see light, it moves through this wire, a disconnection in these bulbs, okay? So this Schrodinger dude said that he knew somehow to put the equation between a small piece of mass and some, uh, some, a spring that's a, or, or a field that it moves. But it was crazy, crazy science. So quantum mechanics, it, it came from here. How the waves are moving. They are different frequency on volume and time and you cut, catch them. Maybe they have 3000 kilometers per second. Maybe they do not have. There are small waves and big waves, you produce it with it, different kinds of sparkle like this. Believe me or not, you sparkle something. In uh, some frequencies, you transmit uh, the radio signals. All of them of electromagnetic waves, like in, in a microwave, in, uh, the, they invented the cattle radiation, like uh, because you see the electricity must flow from here to here, must be a movement. So if you have two two parts, this is the sparkle. If you have two parts, because it must move, okay? You captivate this, you produce alpha rays and gamma rays. And, and all of them are 
all of them are movement to a, to hear something that you do not know what it is it is light it is a, it is electricity with mass and light it is a combined field with magnetism electricity and light field we do not know but that's stupid okay you can make some connection you have some piece you captivate this field you say what is the strength what big energy does have how do you hit this but so Einstein what did what he did energy equal mass times c square what through what how the electricity moves the mass through a wire a big video but I don't understand but I'm telling you that the whole science is false Einstein what he did he did how a wave of light moves and hits with mass equal energy equal mass square I will tell you I will tell you in some my video what happens in, from the uh, Leibniz point of view if you if you accelerate this body to the speed of light I will tell you from the uh, from the Leibniz point of view from kinetic energy you can barely break a mountain <laughs> if you accelerate a kilogram at with a speed of light because you put one and a half mass time velocity you have a kilogram times c square and it is not implying that you cannot reach the speed you can reach the speed of light it will tell you how big will be the energy released on a mountain with a piece of one kilogram multiplied by c square you can barely break a mountain <laughs> so so i've told you already okay maybe i'll so so this is a big video but if you do, I'm saying this like always, if you do not have patience, they are tricking you. And they work at the hydrocentral power plants and there, there is a big turbine with some copper wirings and some iron. And you spin them up, the water does this, okay? So you put, put some measurements that to take money on the bastards. You cannot give them free lights free, okay? So you must uh, invent some. What is the frequency? You see, this is the frequency. I change the frequency, you see? So what's the frequency of passing through a tube of the water to, to, to put a meter on it? And in this way, they pretended that they knew the smallest meter, like a uh, Feynman was like this. We know the electron is decimal electron, not knowing what the electron is. And I'm telling you the truth, but if you do not believe, they are lying to maintain their jobs all over the planet. And this is the scene of this generation. 50 years ago, the, the 12th degree school was not obligati obligativity. And it's still crazy stuff. They, they, they are constraining to, to teach, to, to learn far science. And you are wondering then, then why they could not learn because it's crazy. That's why, because it's crazy. 90% of the science is crazy. So, so again, they can isolate a piece like this. They observe like a piece of, uh, like this from a mountain. Uh, um, uranium, okay? He emits something. They do not know what. They do not know what. And and the bombs are te thermic with thermo with with fire basically with five hundred Celsius degrees with fire basically. They they are said like high uh, hydrogen hydrogen bombs and thermical bombs. So so. They are thermic, they make 500 uh, degrees Celsius degrees. So they took a piece from the mountain like this. And you observe that it emits something. If you put it and you understand that they do not know what it is. Because you can register this with a microphone. With a microphone. You put the microphone, there are some scanners with microphone. You put the microphone near a uranium rock and you register so the microphone, what it is? It is wires like copper wiring to make to produce some some function between a, between a geometry of your words and the geometry of electricity. It is a correspondence. They do not know even this because Bell did this. Bell invented the speaker, the telephone, and and the microphone all at once. 
So you put a microphone on a rock and you captivate something with it. You can hear it on the speaker. What it, it is emitting. And you do not know because they are keeping this secret. They can captivate this and can blow it and flow it through something. like. And you see it like light. And you see like light. They did this at the universities in America. Some, some places. Like you do not must know this. So they can, can captivate this in electromagnetic field. It means that it responds electromagnetically. And this has some energy, thermal energy. The thermonuclear bombs, the word come to me. Thermonuclear bombs because, because, because the bomb is with thermal energy. It is a regular bomb that it is enhanced with thermal energy. 5,000 degrees that is produced by the rock because you understand so they can captivate a small piece a small piece from uranium from from a sparkle you understand but are these particles have some co coherent laws this is if you understood I am I being logic but you must you must listen okay so I intersect it with Sabine the only part that I'm, I'm uh, agree with, I'm agreeing with, with her, but you do not understand that even the 16 particles were light in 70s. They do not exist. The boson, the, they do not exist. You, they were, they are taking money and they are searching like antimatter now to produce antimatter through, through what? through electricity, accelerating electricity, they are crazy, my friend. And they take money, the Chinese made uh, 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 accelerator, like particle accelerator. In Europe, there is one between Switzerland and, okay, so, so in America, another one. But I'm telling you, they are taking money from the government and they do not do anything. So to justify the works and, Everybody should should stay by uh, being paid and d d to do nothing, okay? So you do not understand that they are bad people and they want money. PhD, PhD, professor doctors, but they are lying the entire planet. These professor doctors lie that you can make fusion between hydrogen and iron. These professor doctors lie that they knew the temperature from light from the distance. These professors are telling you that the light is switching through red wear. These professors are telling you that some doper crazy stuff, if you, there is some change in electromagnetic field, these professors are telling you that you can see a body from billion trillions. These professors are lying to you that the galaxies are something that they are not. The galaxies are small pieces. 3,000 kilometer distance, Earth, Moon distance. 90% of the galaxies are simply stars not having much bigger distances than the Earth, Moon distance. And they're small pieces, million, trillions. You are wondering that there exist some crystalline structures and some, some, some uh, alloys that produce light. Look, look. So, these guys are lying to you that the gravity makes spherical body the planets. They are not made spherical through grab force of Newton force. We only know the connection, atomic connection, like chemical, chemical, chemistry connection. So in this way, you must find how the planets were made. And I'm telling you, were made in a cloud, a chemistry conglomeration on the pressure to make sphere to be a spherical. This professor are lying the Big Bang. This professor will lying every, every all of this. And I'm telling you, these professors are crazy. These particles they are in their mind. And they do not have any shame to, to keep the, the children in school. So you see my heart is you, you see I cannot joke even. I, I am like very who knows me but many who knew me, but I have a few friends I had, okay? Uh, but I was a very happy person, but I discovered this. It is not important. You do not believe that we can go to the planets, we can go to the stars. And you believe them. And I've told you, that's why I've told you. 90% of the science is wrong. Not chemistry even is wrong. <laughs> maybe, so maybe, maybe I will do many videos like... Uh, it will not 
be enough a year, two years of videos. That's why I put even one a day. Uh, be Sundays. I do not put videos Sundays. Okay, so. Uh, but even the, the, this is the reason. I have many things to tell you. Okay. So they do not have any relation on energy. This rock you do not know what is the relation between the energy and the, the mass. You do not know. In what condition this becomes uh, open to electricity? You do not know. We do not know this hour. There are fields of investigation, real investigation. They put the people on stupid investigation. They search particles that do not exist. So if you understood, you can isolate some sparkle in electromagnetic electromagnetic fields. Even even the uranium particles that are emitted are responding. So they are not neutrons. They are, they are fooled. You are not fooled, okay? They are fooled. Even the electron, the proton, I'm telling you, that is possible. That will not be the ato the atomical movement, like planetary movement of the atoms was crazy stuff. You do, you do not know the matter, there's real... Uh, so these guys are lying to you, okay? And they are keeping the children in school arrested and, and they do not know... Even the thermodynamics is false. It's made on some... So I've told you, okay? You believe me or not, I only wanted to tell you, I'm telling you like 3,000 times because because it is important okay i only wanted to tell you that we live in a, a sphere and we cannot see the universe they invented all of this it is it is scary you understand how they rule our lives you listen this sabine that how they lied Hey, I don't actually think that those particles I'm going on about here exist, but please give me money anyway because I'm smart and maybe while I write useless papers I'll have a good idea about something else entirely. I'm sure that'll fly. You are wondering that there's some bad people for money will do anything. That standard particle table is false. There not exist 16 particles. The photon, it is not know what it is. If I'm telling you the truth, you, you are believing that. I only wanted to tell you that our galaxy is a sphere and the galaxies are not galaxies like our galaxy. They are stars. Or if you maintain the term that they are galaxies, like you make the difference between one bulb and a cumulus of bulbs. A oh, bulb is a star and a cumulus of bulb of galaxy, but they are not gravitational systems like solar system and planets. And our galaxy is surrounded by clouds, hydrogen, oxygen, clouds. And the galaxies are put like this, in a membrane that has 20 billion kilometers, extraordinary distances. F imagine, imagine 20 billion kilometers full of, with, with street lights, full. 20 billion kilometers in what in every direction. 20 billion kilometers in this, like in a in a ring of sphere. Because inside there's four billion kilometers. Semi-void. Because this is this field, the electric field that we do not know. That is this is the force of gravity that hit in circular to maintain planets. This field ignites the stars, and the Bible says that it exists a field. The firmament that it was named the sky, but he interpret that it is a strong like congeal, like a, like you congeal ice because it may is made in water to 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 trick your okay? key, but it's electromagnetic field. I'm telling you. So imagine that you'll go a la, at Pluto, at Pluto, four billion four billion kilometers. And then you imagine in all direction from Pluto, full of stars, of, of light bulbs, like street light bulbs, full, because there is an electromagnetic field there. And there are many ways to produce light through gases, electroshocking gases, noble gases. By, by you see, by some crystalline, like the, this, this place on laptops, and ele ele electro, electroshock, with different colors, like this with alloys, with this. Imagine all the, that you know about lights and you imagine that you do not have any constraint that to be spherical to produce light.
And these bulbs demonstrate they are not even spherical, these bulbs. And these, these are made spherical just because we made them spherical. You can make them like a cube like. This is a lead uh, bulb, but, but even that incandescent bulb. Okay? Imagine that all the possibilities that we no, do not know even from Pluto's 20 billion kilometers full of every possibility to make life. This is the our galaxy looks. And when the, the, when it finishes, the star finish, there are still 20 billion kilometers with those stars, with hydrogen, oxygen. With those stars, hydrogen, oxygen, 20 billion. And there could be light beyond this. There could be fire, light. We do not know how the matter is. It will be arranged. There could be galaxies made from, from Mercury. A big ball of Mercury voided inside with planets inside and surrounded by Mercury. There could be things like this. We do not know how matter will arrange. These guys were lying everything. We know all the forces. That's what I have told you. The strong forces are told for they are lying. Okay. You do not know what keeps the atoms together. Only from indirect engineering stuff. To what is the breaking point? Force per mass per per volume and. And if you, if you make some arrangement to the atom, the carbon demonstrate this in, in another geometry, you cannot infer what is the strong force of, of connection of carbon. Because you simply rearrange them. The same atom that you produce, uh, you write with, with the same atom, then you produce uh, diamonds, okay? So imagine from Pluto 20 billion kilometers a sphere with thought full of, of lights. Small like this, big ones. But I'm telling you the 90% are smaller than the moon. And you do not have the need to have a bigger body than the moon to produce light. Imagine a light bulb, a moon dimension light bulb. And this, our sun must produce warmth from the, you, and it is made from iron. So you understand the science is wrong. You understand? I only wanted to tell you this, but, but I will not stop. An hour video, an hour and something video, but I've told you that all the science that exists is false. <laughs> okay, so there could be galaxies made. Imagine a big ball of, of mercury and something voids it inside. It keeps like electromagnetic. If, the, if, it, if, it, if it is true that many material respond to electromagnetic fields, imagine that you produce an electromagnetic field inside a, a big ball of, 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 of mercury. And inside you have planets suspended. Like in a semi-void, in this field that you are producing, that keeps the mercury at this, you understand that you can have a galaxy surrounded by mercury. And there's no physical law that interdict this. Maybe solid me mercury, because uh, your north temperature is liquid, but solid mercury, you could have, you, you could have things like this, we do not know how the matter could be arranged, there could be, so what is beyond this sphere, we do not know. We do not know. There could be rivers of, of fire. There could be lights that are rivers of lights from some strange re reason. We do not know. But, and if you reach the, 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 the board of our galaxy, 26 billion kilometers, there are still 26 billion kilometers of, of clouds. So you understand that they are liars. Okay, let's, let's uh, conclude this video. Like in a human manner, but if you listen to me, I am I am sincere, okay? And I discovered this. And maybe two years, but I will tell you this. So ch the Chinese will make another telescope better than the Hubble. And you can see already this in these pictures. You can see on these pictures already that it is matter that they do not want to rec to to approve this to recognize this but there you you can see that exists but 
there will be another picture and another picture and another telescope. These things will be confirmed, okay? So even though if I, I will take it, tell me, it will take me two years, but I will tell you all the wrong things in the science. Goodbye, God bless. I'm saying like a tea science. This is a soluble copy. A big video, but and maybe nobody watches. <laughs> But that's why they are tricking you. And you are saying like you are stupid. You do not know about bosom Higgs. You do not know about lepton, meson. <laughs> Particle that they invented to take their PhDs. Some German dudes said that they, they were maintaining a fifth of the second of the second of the... <laughs> to, to put in a, in a Mendeleev chart to take some price. Do you do not believe that there are some bad people on this earth? You are believing them that to take their money and PhD and then and their jobs on the universities and things like this. And you understand where are the good guys that to admit what I'm saying, to 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 came to start a revolution, a real revolution, scientific revolution. Like it never was a real scientific revolution. It could be. And, and the children, you can do some good for the children to, to understand that it is not correct to maintain them in schools, to teach them bullshit science. They could do all the jobs with seven degrees, like schools, and five degrees schools. They all the jobs that they are made on there, and you are, keep them like in prisons. For some professor to take their money, and I'm telling you, the science is wrong, the particle science is wrong, the quantum mechanics is wrong, Einstein mechanics is wrong, the Schrodinger is wrong, the, all the bullshit, that all, the only two equations, uh, Maxwell and, and Leibniz, and just the, for the fact that they are to demonstrate that the movement it is not done correctly at this hour, okay? So, the thermodynamics is false. They said that they are billion degrees, a million degrees. Like Chinese said that they obtain a million degrees. They are filming black holes like a stupid head. You do not understand. The science is false, okay? So, okay, a big video. Sorry, half sorry, but who will watch it, will watch it. Like in human-like manner, a non-hour that I told you with all my sincere, all my heart. And maybe you'll understand. Goodbye. God bless.